Hey guys, how's it going? My name is Hadi and I'm gonna be doing some vlogs for Danish and, uh, ultimately for jobstillshare.org I'm like Danish, I'm in also an IT field but my field is a little bit different than his um, I've known Danish for a long time you know, he's my you know, best friend kind of like a brother to me, an annoying brother that everybody has but you know, I really like his passion for teaching other people for free, and you know, for you know, sharing skills. And you know, I figured might as well I do it too, because you know, it's it's personal satisfaction you get out of helping others. You know, yeah, there's other things you can get personal satisfaction out of, but to me personally, helping others is you know, a lifelong goal. Um, let's get started. I'll introduce myself. My name is Hadi. I went to University of Maryland College Park. Um, I did two majors. My first major was econ, and while I was doing econ, I got a full-time job at the government uh, as an intern. Well, they, I thought it was an internship, but they told me it wasn't because I was getting paid full-time and I was getting out of 40 hours a week. My title was nothing IT related. It was a student um, trainee or program uh, analyst. And then um, two years later, uh, when I graduated from college, college, I, they asked me, "Hey, you know, what do you want to do? Either, you know, you stay or go back to school." So I decided to stay in school. I did another major. I did uh, cybersecurity, more like information showing, but it was cybersecurity. Finished that. You know, after, then afterwards, uh, I got a little bored. You know what I was doing, so I I did some networking at the government and I got a job. They moved me to a job in a, a, a help desk, call center. It was pretty interesting. I was supporting around 500 users at first and moved on. And on, and on. I worked with Danish. Um, he used to work at this medical facility, setting up labs. Got some experience through him. Then you know I was like, you know what, it's time to move up. Uh, you know, continue networking. You know, I did desktop support for two years, possibly. Then I moved up to system administrator, little tier two, tier three support. Then I ended up going up to, um, after the government, I got a call from, you know, another government agency, but this time as a contractor. Um, so it was the Infosys Defense, you know, DOD related company. And, uh, Got a job as a you know tier three support, and you know I stayed there for a little you know six months. I really didn't like it what I was doing. It was too much, too much work. Well, more of too much of a long commute it was getting on my nerves. That's one thing I learned in my professional career life: is commute. Make sure when you get a job, make sure the commute is tolerable because if not, then your life will be miserable. Anyways. Then finally, um, I got a job close by, near my house, at the uh, Department of Energy, and uh, I still as a contractor because I was getting paid more, so I decided to stick around the contracting life. Uh, this time, I got in as a system engineer. Now, I'll go into more details my future vlogs and what I do, my job, and how system engineers do their daily work, things like this, but right now I'm just going to give you an overall brief review of my personal life. So, stuck around there for two and a half, three years, and you know, one day I got a call from the top four firms, it's one of, known as, you know, Deloitte, Deloitte and Touche, and um, I took the offer and they gave me a lot more money than I was making, and you know, it was really, really different experience, because my previous experience was all into the government, federal government. And going to Deloitte was completely, you know, different uh, wake up call to, you know, how 8 to 5, 8 to 5 or, you know, 9 to 5 job works. And, you know, but Deloitte was not above 40 hours a week, my, my friends. It was more like 60 hours a week, 50 minimum, I guess, if you want to look good, uh, you know, if you want to get that utilization. Stuck around for, you know, 8 months, 9 months figure out it wasn't for me because I love having a personal life I love having to do things without thinking about work you know you come home think about work and things like this so I went back to my old job I went back to the Department of Energy they called me up they're like we need you 
So I figured, why not? I go and uh, continue what I was doing, but I went in as a senior consultant this time instead of system engineer. But I'm still a system engineer, but I'm considered a senior consultant as well. Now I'm still there and I'm loving it. I love what I do. And I'm probably going to be there for a while, but you know, this is my life right now. You know, work. I also love to travel. I just came back from uh, UK, Germany, and UAE, and uh, it was interesting. I'll get into more details about my travel and you know how you guys can work, save money, also go and travel, and enjoy your life rather than just work, work, work. And um, yes, yeah, so every week I'm going to try to make one vlog. Hopefully I'll try to get a different angle next time, but I just wanted to get it started, you know, it's been a while, I've been telling myself I want to start, 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 but stay in touch, subscribe, let me know what you want to hear, what you want me to talk about, I'll talk about anything, I'll talk about girls, money, travel, you name it, I'll talk about, uh, you know, I'll give you my experience, you know, I love to tell people, I love to share my experience, you know, so just ask whatever question and I'll try to answer one by one if not in one vlog I will try to make it one or two so on so forth but yes please subscribe and let Danish or me know what you want to hear and we'll work with you guys all right see you guys next week and actually I kind of like this you know I'm driving and talking I feel like I'm someone important <laughs> well see you guys later